Oh, I am not done with this map by a long shot. What's going on, the guys? Croco here, and you know, funny enough, uh, the game that I uploaded yesterday was the second in line. That was the second chem shock I ever got on Whiteout. This is the first one. I decided to use the other one because it was a flawless. Spoilers: this one <laughs> isn't. Uh, but I still hope you enjoyed the gameplay, and obviously, if you did enjoy the gameplay, be sure to leave a like either now or at the end of the video. That would be fantastic. So what you are watching is my very first chem strike on Whiteout using the Honey Badger with extended mags and obviously the integrated silencer. Okay guys, uh, so I want to welcome everybody that came over from last year's channel. Thank you very much man for the shout out. Uh, there's a whole bunch of you that came over. Welcome to the Krahu family or whatever uh, you want to call it. I hope that you enjoy your stay. I'm going to try the, uh, to up the quality of my videos a little bit. Now. You know, my avid viewers may notice that I added a nice subtle beat to the background. And I think, I think really that, that's what my videos were missing. Some of you guys may like it, some of you guys may not like it, but give it a chance. I enjoy it because I think that whenever I watch a commentary with something in the background, it's just a much nicer, I guess, even if I'm not watching the gameplay, a much nicer listen. Or, or, or something like that. I don't know. So I decided to use it. It came out pretty damn nice in my previous video. So, yeah. I guess the beat in the background is here to stay. So just get used to it, guys. If, you, if you've if you been an avid viewer for years, just give it a chance. And if you really not like it or, or something, then I'm going to remove it. Uh, but to me, it's a nice addition. Um, <laughs> yeah, man. Uh, chem strikes. Oh, my God. You guys caught me. In the beginning, I definitely, hands down, did not care about them at all. And it's not something I do for views at all, because I know that Call of Duty Ghosts in itself is not getting a lot of views on YouTube. That's that's fine with me. It's just a little, I guess, challenge to keep me playing this game. Not that I'm bored of it, but, you know, it's a nice little challenge. I want to get a chem strike on every single map. And the, most, the difficulties that I'm having, especially in Team Deathmatch, is... A, sometimes it's just impossible, um, because once you die once, there's a big, big chance that you're not going to be able to get the chem strike, because usually I die on like a 15 kill streak, 10 kill streak, and there's just not enough time, and obviously, not enough kills. I actually died on a 22 kill streak, but there was nothing I could do anyway. On Sovereign, there was maybe like two more kills left, so I have to share the kills with my teammates, obviously, because this is um, normal. TDM, and this isn't Ground War. So that's just the, the one thing. So it's a nice little challenge for me. I'm not doing this for views or anything like that. You know, whatever happens to my channel happens to my channel. I'm still here. I'm not going anywhere. And also on my Let's Play channel, um, as you guys know, I do have a Let's Play channel. If you want to subscribe to it, link is in the description. Uh, I still haven't finished Dark Souls, but I will try to finish that and do a GTA 5 Let's Play. What do you guys think about that? I absolutely love the game, and I really do think that I would make a kick-ass gameplay from GTA 5. I know a lot of you have played it, but, you know, just give a different spin on it. And if you like it, you can always stop by the Let's Play channel and watch my GTA 5 Let's Plays. Um, I'm doing this on my new channel because I have no idea what the copyright infringements uh, from Rockstar are. I know that during GTA 4 time, they took down videos like fucking crazy, so if they're going to... You know, slap my channel with a copyright infringement. At least it's going to be on my Let's Play channel and not on my main channel. Um, this channel is all about first-person gaming and, you know, brand new games or whatever. But we'll see how things turn out, basically. So there's always an option. And if you're, I don't know, if you want to watch my Dark Souls Let's Play, I'm going to try to resume that. But it's, sometimes it's so difficult. I have over 200... 30 hours on the game and it's just sometimes hard to get motivated because I literally played the living shit out of that game so it's sometimes hard to get motivated to continue to play it but I love the game and I'm definitely going to do a Dark Souls 2 let's play uh, that's going to be on my channel so it's going to be fun it's going to be fun uh, but yeah what can I say I was lagging like a motherfucker during this gameplay man I don't know if it's going to show up and thankfully oh my god I forgot yeah there you go oh there, there I go, jittery, jittering all over, and I was uh, playing with my friend, and I was like, Dude, are you fucking serious? I started to lag when I was on a 22 kill streak. And my friend was like, oh my god, dude, are you serious? And I was like, yeah, man, this is bullshit. But thankfully, this is the key moment. 
Uh, so I didn't know if this guy was looking at me or not, but whatever, I didn't want to take that chance. And some of my bullets went through um, the person and... Where is the other guy? Yeah, I hear them all just trying to rush me in this building. So I'm like, I'm one fucking kill away. I almost died here, just like in my previous video with that sniper. So I'm waiting and I hear him in the building. I was like, for God's sakes, just come upstairs so that I could kill you and I could get my chem strike. And actually, and I do get it right here. And actually, I was very lucky because I don't have a ca capture card to capture PS4 footage yet. But what I do use is PS4 Share, and I didn't manually start it. I didn't manually start PS4 Share, so I was like, at the end of the game, Oh shit, I hope it recorded. And it actually cuts off at the end, where the video stopped. Because it records 15 minutes, and right at the end, when the video cuts off, right as the game ends, so that was the end of the 15 minutes, and a bunch of people rage quit. Um, <laughs> obviously, I guess. So I, I got very, very lucky. Uh, but uh, it was a good time. It was a good time. This is the first ever chem strike I, I got on this map. It was fucking difficult as hell. Believe me, guys. Uh, I've tried many times before, like I said in my previous video. Actually, I don't know if I said it or not, uh, but I'm going to say it now. I tried to chem strike this map, put it on my checklist um, many times before, and every single time. The highest kill streak I ever got was like 21, and always sniper from the back of the map, thermal got me. LMG Thermal got me. Some noob wobbling around got me. Something always stopped me from chem striking this map. And it just so happens that I got two chem strikes on the same map on the same day, which was, you know, pretty cool. So I decided to share it with you guys. And just give it a thought. You know, all the goodies are in the description, so be sure to follow me on Twitter, maybe subscribe to my Let's Play channel, which is going to go active again soon uh, with my GTA 5 Let's Play. So hopefully you will support that too. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, thank you, Lasty, again. Uh, hopefully you guys will not be disappointed with this content. Again, welcome to my family. See you guys next time.